tell you what you can't say. I ain't gonna tell you to do this for your own sake. Haters gonna put your mind in a bad place. So my advice they charge and make your Hey, what's up, YouTube? This your boy PJ2 Hot here. I'm back for another video, and today I'm doing an unboxing of the RTX 4090. Yeah, this is the Gigabyte version. This is the, the Gigabyte OC version. I know, another uh, GPU unboxing, but you guys remember on my last one on the 3080 Ti, I said the next card I would get would be the next generation of car. I said that. I said the 3090, I mean, not, not the 3090, the 3080 Ti would be my last car until the next generation. So now that we're here, I'm buying it. You know, well, I, I've already done bought it. Yeah, I got it. I told you. I went for the 490 because I like just having this one, like this great graphics card. And I can just kind of sit back and just relax. You know what I mean? Not really have to worry about upgrading. We, we, like really and truly, when I had the regular 3080, I didn't really have to upgrade. So this is one I'm trying to just keep this one for the for the the whole time until the next generation comes out again. So hopefully, you know, there's no main, not, not, not unless they release a uh, 3090, I mean a 490 Ti, and that's just so extremely like a huge difference. Maybe, and I mean it's a maybe, but if they don't do that, I'm good. But enough of that, though, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get to this unboxing. You know what I mean? I actually got a pretty busy day today, so I can't go on for too long. I mean, I can, but I can't. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, though, let's get to this unboxing. All right. It was actually supposed to come in yesterday, but uh, not yesterday. It was actually supposed to come in tomorrow, but it actually came in the day early, so I ain't complaining. Nice bubble wrap. I'm gonna pull over and get to that later. Receipt. That's nice. Right there. And here we go. Here we go. You guys can see the Gigabyte RTX 4090. All right, this is uh, 24 gigs of video RAM. From I ain't even looking at it, didn't even know. Yeah, 24 gigs of video RAM. Uh, everything we up. You guys already know the basics about it. Uh, I could, it's crazy because I never got a 3090 and I was starting to want one, but it was very hard to get those, but I managed to get one of these, so I'm happy. So, anyways, though, uh, here's the front. It has RGB as well. Here's the, here's the front. Here's the side, here's the back, whatever. Um, yeah, it has RGB lights around the fan area, and obviously, the, like, the Gigabyte logo up here is also RGB, so that's another thing. So, yeah, um, about as much information you can get on here. It comes with four-year warranty, which I'm definitely going to activate as soon as I get done with this video, because you never know. But anyways, though, let, let's get to this unboxing. Uh, I was trying to try to get the Aorus version, but man, nah. That's even more expensive than this version. And then it's just the AOS version. That junk's being scalped up to $3,000. I'm like, what? Heck no. Uh, go ahead and make sure we can get it. Ouch. I even know I took it out backwards. Get it up. Lay down as gently as we can. And uh, let's see what we can do here. No, you guys can't get it. Thank you. Thank you. This right here is the, I think this is where to keep the warranty and stuff in. If I'm not mistaken, I'll go ahead and get it. I ain't going to take it all out, though. We'll go ahead and get like a little look of it. Yeah, that's the warranty. I think it's a manual on the warranty. Yeah, that's it. But yeah, all cars come with that. Most people probably don't, aren't really going to care about that. But, uh, like me. And holy crap. Holy crap, this is 
huge card. Um, here's the NVIDIA adapters, which obviously be careful with these. You know, we've been hearing about these burning uh, GPUs and everything. Um, I've actually been hearing that a lot, how it kind of burns the, uh, the plug-in port. And uh, apparently, do not bend these adapters when you put it in there. Do not bend it in a 90 degree angle or do not twist it, you know, side to side or what, however, make sure you keep it as straight and not as bent as possible. Uh, obviously, I've already ordered a, um, a uh, cable mod cable from, from obviously the company Cable Mod, which will be replacing this because this is just not a good adapter, but I'm gonna temporarily have to use this for a little bit. So I'm gonna make sure I'm just, just as careful as I can possibly be. So for those of you who don't know, now you do be careful with this adapter. Uh, if you can buy you a new one or an, an aftermarket one before you receive your GPU, then I highly suggest that. Here are plugs and screws. This is for the uh, bracket, which is in here. Comes with these little brackets so that way you don't have any GPU sag. I was actually going to order one on Amazon myself, but I might just use this one. I don't know. But uh, yeah, there's that. Now the grand finale, what we all are here for. All right, uh, holy crap! This is a big GPU. size of this. This is insane. This is insane. Video is crazy for that. Wow. Uh, be careful. Try to keep things as neat as I possibly can. So, yeah. Look at the size of this GPU. <laughs> this is insane. I know it will fit in my case, but I think it barely will. I don't know, I could be wrong, because I have a full-size tower for a reason. But holy crap. This car, but uh, man. So yeah, here's the, uh, I call these the top of the car. You know what I mean, that's why I call these. And then uh, obviously you got the plastic and everything on it, which I'll take off later when I'm getting ready to put it in the my system. And uh, over here is where the uh, the Gigabyte logo was at, where the RGB would be at. So, And then at the bottom, you know, the fans, whenever they're on and spinning, the RGB lights in here would light up as well. So that's something else if you guys like that. That would definitely be for people who, uh, well, that would definitely be great for people who like to mount their cards in just like that. So, you know... Um, but yeah, this was the uh, unboxing. I give you guys a pretty better, like a good look at it. This was the unboxing here, as you guys can see, of the RTX 4090. This is the Gigabyte OC edition. Uh, but anyways, though, matter of fact, I probably will let you guys see what it looks like in the system as well. So that way, you know, you guys can get a pretty good look on how it looks like when it's actually running. So yeah, I'll be back with that. All right, guys, I'm back. Yeah, so I just got this... Uh, GPU installed as you can see it's definitely massive uh, oh yeah I forgot to put my uh, little Aorus uh, minifigure right there but whatever but um yeah so yeah it, as you can see the card is massive you know what I mean uh, I was actually nervous that the card would be too long where it wouldn't uh I thought it was gonna be like too much I guess width to where it wouldn't fit where the uh, hard drive bracket is at but luckily you know it's just the right size I needed to, so that way, like, I didn't have to take out the uh, hard drive bracket, so that's good. But, um, yeah, so, yeah, th this is what it looked like. Yeah, it took me a while to figure out how to get these cables, because, like, before, when I installed it, like, the cables were extremely bent, and I was like, no, they said do not do that. So, you know, uh, I'm, I'm actually pretty nervous with this GPU uh, adapter right here, man. I'm 
waiting on cable mod to ship the new one out because you know there's two options you either go to cable mod or go to Corsair's site because Corsair sells a uh, new cable for this that you can plug directly into the, uh, the the power supply but they are out of stock so they I, I've been waiting I've been checking them as well to see if they're going to be in stock and I'll just buy from them because Corsair because sh Corsair ships kind of a uh, a pretty quick or you have to buy a new uh, PCI 5.0 or PCIE whatever you call it 5.0 uh, power supply and they come with a cable that plugs directly into there into here so you know those are two options but I don't want to go spend two hundred dollars on the new power supply I will if I got to but you know if I don't have to I'm not going to you know so I haven't tested out any games yet but yeah I'm kind of nervous with the way it is especially when I put the uh, side panel on it does push it in just a little bit and while it's not bent too terribly you know what I mean like what I mean bent is like you start bending it around this area right here and it's pretty fine with where it's at so it's not bad but I'm definitely not going to keep this adapter though I'm not this, this is getting replaced as soon as I can get it replaced it's out you know what I mean so yeah but anyways though I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like inside the system and I'm going to get ready and you know, like basically the first off like edit this video get it uploaded and then i'm gonna test some games to see how it goes so hopefully i should you know what i'll definitely give you give you my first impressions of this car i think that'd be a good thing to do but uh anyways though uh, this is uh this was an unboxing of the gigabyte rtx 4090 uh, this your boy pj2 hot peace I'm just trying to get my mind right They tell me hold up and listen because it's alright Your independence I applaud cause it's all might You feel exposed and pressure to get it alright 